Hey everyone, it's Tuesday. <laughs> Along with my deep sigh, I literally, I almost literally rolled out of bed and am recording this because I rolled out of bed a little later than I usually do. It's Tuesday the 17th. We're playing Persona 5 Royale one day at a time and I'm calling it Royale now because we're in it. We're in the DLC. We're no longer in vanilla Persona 5. So it's worth adding a couple more so labels to, I'd say. Um, we are sort of, well, we're inching towards a trip to Mementos. But before we do that, we are waiting to spend some time with all of our bestest friends. Like what you're about to see right now. Kodo has pulled us aside for a special conversation here. Um, she's glad she found us. She wants to speak with us. I just want to talk. That's all. If you have, if you have the time, is that okay? Yeah, of course. Thank you very much. Oh, she said it better than I can. Then let's keep moving for now. Let's keep moving for now. Well, yeah, we gotta get to class. If we don't keep moving. We won't get to class. <laughs> Dude, something is wrong with Ushimaru. What do you mean? I don't know, something's up. I guess it's not wrong, but he's all different. Anyone know what he's saying? Ushimaru who? A strict teacher. He's a chalk-throwing marksman. Oh, say no more. Uh-oh. What exactly is different? His personality. What, he's super nice now? That's just it, he's so nice it's creepy. No matter who I ask, they tell me he's always been like this. We got people saying he's basically the school's own Buddha. It does sound as if he's been enlightened, I suppose. Doctor, Maruki has changed someone's personality. Okay, so the text-to-speech reader does not understand that a period does not necessarily end a sentence. If you really wanted to change, then yes, it's possible. What? Ushimaru of all people? It's like how I wish to be Kasumi. It's like your own situations, most probably. Something in his past must have been overwritten. It's also possible his personality just changed, independent of all external events. You figure the real Ushimaru went through something bad? Maybe he was too nice to everyone. The students took advantage of him and he went full delinquent? Ah, <sighs> that would be dramatic. Well, we can only, we can speculate all we like. He's the only one who could say for sure what's changed. It's still difficult to understand. So if it would serve their happiness, even one's personality can change. Exciting answer option. It's not a change of heart. I mean, it is, but it's not our change of heart. You know what I mean? Exactly. I feel like I liked him in the first place, but this is freaking weird. I'm getting so mad, I'm gonna go to sleep. Is that even a thing people do when they're mad? Honestly, you could always just pay attention in class. That Ushimaru, huh? It's hard to believe. I guess we'll have to check it out when we're in his class. Which I guess is not today. <laughs> Kodo looked like she had something on her mind. I wonder if there's anything we can do. Yes, sir. Uh oh. Triple seven text blew up my phone. I don't think so. Where is she, do you think? Probably... Uh... Student council room? Hello. Oh. Ab, you're here. Can we talk for a little while? She's saying everything. They should just make her say that. They recorded the voice line for it. There's something I need to tell you. See ya. Like hey, hey. 
Yeah, I'd say let's hang out with Makoto. Thank you very much. Let's get going then. I don't know if you have to do these the day that they talk to you or not. I don't think you do. I assume you don't, but we're doing them anyway. I'm sorry. Hey, it's Makoto's room, by the way. Welcome. She's got a cool little uh, box with CDs and books and pandas. <laughs> sorry for calling you over so suddenly. There's something I just had to tell you. What is it? She's panned up, actually. She's. Oh, no, I think this makes sense, though, because I think this is the character that her and the girl and her confidant storyline bond over. Honestly, I wanted to apologize. I couldn't back you up when you needed me the most. It's not true. But it is true. Ever since the new year, I was stuck in Dr. Maruki's false reality. Hey. You remember that time before I joined the Phantom Thieves, when I called you to the student council room? I challenged you on your ideals, threatened to expose you all, as if I knew anything about what was going on. But since then, I've learned so much from the Phantom Thieves, from you. You've saved me more times than I can possibly count. After all that, I promised myself that if you were ever in trouble, I would leap in to save you. But I forgot that vow. I just threw it away so I could cling to my father and sis. <laughs> It's awful to know that all along, I was so weak and self-centered. We're all kind of like that, huh? Ugh. It's not your fault. Even if it isn't, does that really make it okay? Considering all the ways I made your struggle harder, even unknowingly, I can't just let that go. It's you know, serious. I think I'm more lonely than I was willing to admit. Father never spent much time at home. When he was there, he always had his mind on some case, and Sis put all her time into her work, for both our sakes. I respected them both so much, and I still do, of course, but I can't just let them take care of me forever. It's your decision? <laughs> it's what I think, at least. Though it's a fairly new idea for me. If I hadn't been in this situation, I'm not sure it would even have occurred to me. In any case, I've made my decision. <gasps> Question mark. Hey, so I'm done sitting quietly and being doing as I'm told. Well, that's we, that's, we did a whole arc about this. If I'm weak or self-centered or lonely or too dependent on my family, then that's my problem to fix. But my pain's still a part of me. All the struggles, your support, it's what helped me stand up for myself. I can't lose that. I'm not exactly abandoning the person I was, but I figure trying to bottle it up will only make my life harder. I want to be able to look, uh, I want to be able to look at the most awful, disgraceful parts of myself and still be able to say, so what? <laughs> what if I just, what if I just show up to everybody's room Everybody who I love and care about and just say and just ask them a bunch of questions. Stupid rhetorical Thank questions. You very much. It's a relief to know so you're supporting me. If I can get everyone to understand me and who and really see who I am, then I think that'll give me strength. If I'm ever tempted like this again, I'll remember to stay true to myself. Even if it's not a conscious decision. That's why I wanted to apologize. I'll give it a try. I guess I'm not completely ready to stand on my own just yet, but I'll keep trying, and I won't run away. <laughs> okay, so I don't remember what any of the other ones of these look like. I don't know how you combine a, a humanoid motorcycle with a motorcycle. But I guess we'll find out. Oh, okay. Yeah, all right. This is me? Oh, I get it now. All right. On yes. <laughs> that might have been loud. I'm sorry if that was loud. Louder than everything else I've said so far. It's strange. All it took to make my heart stronger was to put myself first. Yeah, that's weird. <laughs> Sounds like you. Sorry, but it looks like I still have to rely on you a while longer. So I hope you'll be prepared. See you later. Thanks for staying over so late too. I'll see you later. See, see you later. Checkmate. Oh fuck yeah. 
Um, what do I get rid of? Uh, I guess maybe flash bomb at this point. Probably flash bomb at this point. It's just it's medium physical. It's not that important. Increases allies chance of inflicting burn free shock by by 50%. What was it before? I'll never know. <laughs> All right. We fishing again? What are we doing tonight? Ah, oh, you're back. Oh, you're back. <laughs> What's up? It's me, Sojiro. Hello. I lie, Sajiro. Find your own style. My girlfriend, Oya. It's, I think it's time. 200 yen to get there, 1,000 yen to fish. All worth it. Let me in. let me add them. Thank you. It's time now. Well then. Start him off with the large boily. Now he is here again. That's too far, probably right. For some reason, it baked in my my YouTube. Uh. I had Google Chrome open and it baked the YouTube screen in the back of my screen. But it doesn't always do that when the screen, it's not burned in. When the screen, oh, you're not media. Oh no, why aren't you, hey, excuse me. What? Uh, it's like baked into the screen because when the screen goes completely black, you can't see it. There we go. Oh. Sir, Ana has a tag on it. What do you want to do? Okay, I gotta check the prizes. Uh, let's see how you did. Let's get four large boilies. A suspicious boily. I have enough for the high tech rod, but I don't think I need it. I think the miracle rod's good enough for me. Well done. What's up, little guy? <laughs> Figuratively, nice. little guy, because you're quite big, actually. Whoa! The delicious bitterly. What do you want to do? Zoom in more large, and then I think it's time. Come on, I mean, come on. You tell me that's not close enough to you. You're not interested in this. Oh, yes, sir. Yes. Oh, something else got it. Wow, all right. He really wasn't interested. Whoa. Another delicious bitterling. They're all winners though. What do you it's time. Do? I will obtain him. Fortunately, it can't be the thumbnail of every episode, but <laughs> if only it could. Is that close enough? Nope. Okay, a little farther. A little farther. I mean, that's it, right? Too close? All right, all right, all right. Fish pit. Hit, he's, he is picky, I understand. God, stop moving closer to me. I mean, that will make it easier for me eventually, but it's making it more difficult for me right now. There it is. Whoa. Oh my God. Oh, wow. Okay, this one's way more difficult than yesterday. Get in the red, dude. Dude, he is like... For real? Yeah, dude, I know. Okay. I need to update the for real counter at the end of this. Okay, so on the regular rod, I would have lost by now. Which is why the miracle rod is, is objectively better. Oh, come on. No. Oh, my God. Woo. Woo. Ichigaya Kingpin. Caught the Ichigaya Kingpin. And I got a for real counter tick.
Fishing spot looks so lonely without his shadow, you know what I mean? Look at this carp and its tag. All right. I think this is the last one, and I always like to have a large boy for the next one, so let's go medium. Let's go medium. Yeah, turn all the way around. Come all the way around. Yes, sir. All right. And, and then with the little treasure trout. Oh, okay. I had one. More. I had time for one more. It turns out. Let's get a little guy. <laughs> you know what I mean. Let's get this little guy out of here. Ooh. Gotcha. Yes. Nice. Tokyo Bitterling, welcome yes. to the resistance. Whoa. Whoa! I caught him again, baby. You throw him back in this pond all you want. I'll catch him every time. 16, 16, 550, 24, 700, and Let's then a little guy. All right, we're well on our way. We're not, we're never gonna get here, but we can get this guy now. Which might be better, to be honest, than the fish god's badge, but the fish god's badge is a is an item of honor. You know what I mean? Let's just do this now or else I'll forget. All right. It's time, it's time, for, unfortunately it's time for me to go home. Had a moment where I looked at my recording levels to make sure that my microphone wasn't muted. I was so scared. Stop by any time. Stop by any time. Oh, I do that voice maybe yawn in real life. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's gonna do it for today. Tomorrow I will be live. Good morning. Also, we're gonna be hanging out with Haru. It seems like. Do not rush. Thank you for watching. Be live on Twitch tomorrow, twitch.tv slash DTJ Composer. Uh, if you want to watch me live, you can do that. If not, it'll end up on YouTube just like all the other ones do. Thank you for watching. It's going to do it for me. Bye.